Congratulations! Today is Monday, January 8th. I'm Kaylee. And I'm Kayla. And here's today's GTV episode and daily announcements. Here's a Faces in the Crowd semester review. Hey Glacier, I'm here with Nick and Isaac. Hi Glacier, I'm here with Mary Grace. And we're Alright, what's up GTV? We're here with Mac and Asher. Glacier, I'm here with uh, Trenton. Hi GTV, I'm here with Alina Humala. And we're going to ask you some questions about how your semester was. To begin with, who is your favorite teacher this semester? Ooh, my favorite teacher, probably Mr. Johnson for uh, my outdoor pursuits class. Alright, who is your favorite teacher? It's a tie between Troy Smith and David Barr. Ooh, that's a good one. How often are you late to first period? Um, I, pretty much every single day, at least five minutes late. <laughs> at the very least. And you? Again, every single day, between <laughs> five to ten minutes late. Sorry, Barb. <laughs> and what class do you goof off in the most? Probably this class, Intro to Engineering. <laughs> and how about you? Intro to Engineering. <laughs> all right, thanks. First of all, uh, who was your favorite teacher this semester? Probably Miss Fritz or Miss Spies. All right, and what class did you goof off in the most? First period English with Miss Fritz. <laughs> all right, and lastly, uh, lastly, overall, how did you feel about this semester? I felt pretty good. Could have been better some days, but I mean, not bad overall. Okay, thank you. <laughs> some, some semester review questions. So who was your favorite teacher this semester? I can't pick favorites, or some teachers might kill me, uh, but I'm have to go with Fritz in my seventh period. And yours? Um, probably Mr. Allison or Ms. Yotis. Okay. Um, which class did you skip or miss the most? I missed uh, my first period algebra a lot. I missed probably sixth and seventh a lot for sports or speech and debate or whatever it is. How do you feel overall about this last semester? It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Yeah. Similarly, it's, it's good. And we're going to ask you some questions about your first semester. Who was your favorite teacher this semester? Um, probably Mr. Allison, uh, greatest guitar teacher that I like, could have had. He's taught me a lot, and he's super chill dude. How do you feel about this last semester? Um, well, uh, since graduating early, uh, I don't got to go to uh, the second semester, so I'm, overall I'm pretty hyped because, I mean, that's when the money starts coming in. And we're going to ask some semester reviews. So how do you feel about this last semester? Um, I feel like I could have done a lot better, but um, it was pretty fun. I mean, powered through it. Yeah. Um, what was your favorite teacher this semester? Uh, I would have to say my math teacher, Mr. Smith. I don't know, math has just been a hard topic for me. And it's just like, I like having him as a teacher because he is just like easy for me, I guess. Okay. And how many absences do you have this semester? Or how often do you skip? Uh, I kind of like skip a lot. Uh, I guess 15 absences. Uh, yeah. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Yeah. And here's a story from period five. I'm Tabitha and I'm here with uh, Tobin. And what are your classes next semester? I've got Theta Arts, Acting and Stage, Advanced Acting, AP Physics C, the Dual Enrollment Stats, and AP French. And what are you looking forward to next semester? I'm looking forward to a lot of the plays. Adam Check is directing A Mode of Mystery that I'm really excited for, and Menson's directing Tinkerbell at the end of the year. I'm excited for that one too. That's great. Thank you. Hi GTV, I'm Egan and I'm here with Tori Brown and we're asking like what are your goals for the next semester? So first off, what classes are you taking? Um, I'm in AP Lit and AP Government, Personal Finance, uh, Catch Me in Earth Science for sure. <laughs> very, very studious. Um, what are your big goals for the next semester? Definitely that 4.0 as you, at per use, you know, um, and uh, dropped math so I'm feeling pretty good about that too. That's great. Thank you, Tori. I'm here with Micah Pichardo. And what are your classes looking like next semester? Uh, I'm going to have the core classes. Uh, then I'm going to have band, electronics, too, uh, and health. That's great. What are you looking forward to next semester? Uh, definitely electronics, too, because I, I mean, I just love that class. It's really fun. Shout out to Mr. Smith. He's awesome. Thank you. Hey, I'm here with Miss May. And Miss May, what classes are you teaching next semester? Uh, U.S. History and AP U.S. History. Nice. And then what are some big goals that you have? Uh, get through all the content in AP so the kids are ready to take the test and uh, start the track season off really well. Oh, sorry. <laughs> nice. Thank you. We're thrilled to announce that this week's Glacier High Student of the Week is senior Ethan Grant. <laughs> Hi GTV, I'm here with Student of the Week. Ethan Grant. And why do you think you were nominated? Um, I don't know. I think I work pretty hard in class. Yep. And who do you think nominated you? 
Um, I'm going to guess St. Ange. For my calc class. That is correct. Um, she said that you're always working hard and ready to go in calculus, all while working through soccer season as well and speech and debate. What radio would you like to play? I'm going to do 80s on 8. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you. Here is what you need to know. Army National Guard, juniors and seniors. If you are interested in hearing more about what the Army National Guard has to offer, stop by the Career Center at 11.05 a.m. today. The Kalispell Lakers will hold a player-parent sign-up meeting for the 2024 season on today, Monday, Jan Monday, January 8th at 6 p.m. at the Hampton Inn in Kalispell. Any questions, please see Coach Brink. Attention all DECA members. DECA will meet Tuesday, January 9th from 5.30 to 7 p.m. in A106. See Mr. Monroe if you have any questions. FCCLA will have a pizza lunch meeting in room A108 on Thursday, January 11th. Hope to see you there. Attendance incentive appeal policy. Appeal forms are now available to pick up in the office. All appeals are due by 3.30 next Friday, January 12th. Thanks for watching. Remember to respect yourself, respect others, and respect the building. Grit